Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to a new little video. So it's actually a requested video. I haven't filmed a update of what's in my handbag since, yeah, for about two or three years. So yeah, um, people just want to know what's in my handbag in 2020. What can I say? Uh, a couple of people requested that I did this video. I thought it'd be kind of fun. It's my day off today. So I thought I would give it a little film. Um, if you didn't know and you haven't watched my what was in my handbag like two years ago video. Uh, I don't actually have a handbag. I find them really annoying. I mean, I do have handbags, but like on a day-to-day -day basis, I just hate using them. Uh, I much prefer having like a backpack, which is what I've got. So this is my Forelli backpack. So just so you can see, it's got like two long straps at the back, a little handle. It's getting a little bit worn. Uh, I can't pretend it. Um, so Frelly isn't leather, um, but yeah, it's starting to like fray a little bit on the shoulder straps as well. They're starting to go a little bit. I'm just hoping that it holds out because I absolutely love this bag and I'm really struggling to find a replacement. I picked this up from John Lewis and I think it was about £60 in the sale about two or three Christmases ago. It was a present for my Christmas present from uh, my other half and yeah, I absolutely love it. Yeah, so it's perfect for like every day, go to work kind of throw your stuff in it. It's big enough to get like a couple of pints of milk in if you really needed to. A little bit of shopping on the way home from work. So if you needed to pick up some like bacon, mushrooms, all that kind of stuff. Everything fits in here, which is why I love it so much. So the front pocket is where I tend to put all my makeup in. So let's have a little look and see what I got. So first of all, I've got a fragrance. So this is the Twilly de Hamis, um fragrance it's like a little mini bottle so super cute absolutely love this i got it i think it was in an advent calendar maybe can't really remember but oh it's so gorgeous such a lovely kind of everyday scent perfect if you know you just need a little bit of something in the afternoon and you want to freshen up so yeah i love mini bottles like this i've got a fenty um lip gloss so this is just a mini fenty lip gloss this is in this shade Fenty Glow uh, Gloss Bomb and yeah it's like just like a mini Fenty lip gloss. Oh okay I love this. So this is my um and more of it's a Queen of Hungary Mist. So it is a mini but it's just perfect for when you're out and about and you need a little kind of refresh. Um, I spent quite a lot of time frowning and I don't think I realise I do it. And sometimes it's just kind of nice just to give my face a little mist and it just feels like it relaxes all the muscles in my face. It's gorgeous. Um, it helps set your makeup, makes your skin look more dewy. Um, it's beautiful. So yeah, I really, really like that. Um, I got that in the uh, Feel Unique uh, beauty kit service when they first launched it and I absolutely am um, so happy to have this. The mister on it is great and you can actually refill this one. So uh, if you've got another like face mister that's not as good, you could potentially use the bottle again. Um, I've got a Burberry lipstick. So this is kind of a bit more of a sultry colour um, just in case I need a little bit something more dark and sultry. This is in the shade, let's have a little look dark rosewood so this was in the feel unique uh christmas box and yeah it's a beautiful color really gorgeous lovely formula it's very creamy and yeah just sits on the lips beautifully but yeah i don't own much burberry stuff so it's nice to have that in my handbag a color pop li uh, lipstick this is um appy um which is just like a nice kind of like everyday nude colour. Um, I wear that quite a lot just you know when you fancy a little bit of lipstick. Then I've got oh my favourite gloss ever which you now can't get and it's just gorgeous um, and it's the multivitamin gloss by Isadora. It's covered in some like toothpaste or something I don't know uh, but yeah it is uh, a vitamin 90% vitamin uh, lip gloss and it's got antioxidant lip ACE and Q10 so I tend to wear that with my Huda Beauty lip pencil so I'll kind of like 
kind of like smush it all in and it just looks really beautiful with this so uh, this is in the shade flirt and I'm very excited because I do hear that Huda Beauty is coming to Boots and I have a really good big Boots in my city centre so I'm really hoping we get Huda Beauty so I can get some more um, lip products from them because I do love them. Oh I've got one more thing, uh, it's a little Charlotte Tilbury mini and it is the uh, Pillow Talk. So this is actually, I'm actually wearing Pillow Talk on my lips right now but I've got the gloss version. Uh, this is just like the original and yeah I have this mini in my bag just in case I ever need like to have the most amazing lipstick on my lips. That's what it is. Okay so in the back of my bag I have like an extra zip and this is just where I keep like my sanitary wear in case I have the time of the month or whatever or if any of my friends need some emergency sanitary wear and it's also where I keep my um like special foot things so uh, earlier on this year, or last year now, I started suffering some heel pain. I got this condition called plantar fasciitis, uh, where like the heel of your hoot, the heel of your hoot? Uh, where the heel of your foot starts to hurt, so I had to get some special inserts which were very expensive. These cost me like £30. Um, they did really help until I found a pair of shoes that um, alleviate the symptoms quite well so uh, I've always got these as backup. Okay so main part of my bag and then oh my gosh I've got so many sweets in here. Um, so I've got um, uh, chewing gum, I've got the some yes yeah, some chewing gum I picked up at Poundland, I've got some hall soothers in case I get a sore throat and then I've got I didn't even know these were in here, um, I've got some sweets so I've got a Bounty, a Malteser and then I've got three quality streets. Um, I think they were going round at work a few weeks ago and I picked some up. Oh, I've got a strawberry one as well. I picked them up and put them in my bag because I thought, ooh, sweets. Uh, I've got some pens in one of my front pockets in the bag. So I've got like a little marbled coloured one, a one that's kind of, yeah, it's got little sparkly bits in it. That's cute. And like a normal biro. Does anybody else have like biro fear? So I have an issue with biros where I'm too afraid to like walk around with them in my hands because they tend to in like implode on me and I get covered in ink. So I never walk around with these but I always seem to end up with them and I get really scared. So I'm just gonna put that one back in my bag. But yeah, I love pens more like this. this these are safe. Safe pens, not safe pens. And I've got a ton of change, so I don't even know how much I've got. Um, let's have a little look. Um, oh gosh, there's 5p. Uh, so I've got a locker token, a locker token, a locker token, three locker tokens. Looks like I'm getting ready to go to the gym. And then I've got one pound, two pound, three pound, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 71. I'm rich. Okay, so in my bag, what else have I got? Um, I've got a little pot with a unicorn on it. This is where I just put my tea bag. So when I go to work, I take my own cups of tea with me and drinks. So um, I get through lots of different types of teas and stuff at work. So that's where they live. My glossy box water bottle. So if I want to, I can do like cold infused teas or I can do hot drinks. You can put hot drinks in it as well. Um, I don't take it every day to work with me, but if it's like during the summer, I have to have it. Um, and yeah, it's great, great little water bottle. So that was a good gifty from Glossy Box. Umbrella, because it always rains. If you live in Devon, you know it always rains. This was from Primark, I think. Um, and it's still going strong about eight months later. It's filthy, but it's a brolly. I mean, it doesn't really matter what it looks like as long as it keeps you dry. These were a Christmas present actually from Jack. They were from like two years ago, three years ago. Just like some fingerless gloves for when it's cold. There's meant to be like loads of cold weather coming soon. So keys, lots and lots and lots of keys. Ooh, yes, I need to do this. So there's a new pizza place that's opened up and they're doing like a deal where if you download the app, you can get pizza for a fiver. And I was like, oh, 
sounds good. So um, yeah, I'm going to go on their website and download that and get my free pizza purse, my little Poundland purse. It's green because it matches my other bag. Where's my other bag? Let me see if I can swizzle you around. There you go. There's my other bag. Uh, yeah, so it's really cute and it's very diddy and neat and tiny and yeah, bag, purse, a little coffee sachet. So in case I get bored of tea, I've got coffee as well. Caramel latte actually. Mmm, nice. So yeah, that is everything that's in my bag. Um, this year, this January, February, it's February, it's the 1st of Feb. Um, but yeah, that's everything that's in my bag. So I hope you enjoyed having a little rummage, seeing what I've got. Um, let me know your thoughts. What do you keep in your bag? I would love to know. Like mine does tend to find like at the end of the day like loads of receipts in it and I do tend to like want to sort it out straight away. I try not to leave too much in my bag. I sometimes have like spare bags in my bag as well in case I need to do extra shopping but I don't at the moment so I need to put some in. Uh, anyway guys that's everything from me so I hope you are having a fabulous day. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos over the next couple of days. I've got some fun things coming and I'll see you all very soon. Take care guys. Bye!